Hey everybody, welcome back to Universe Jarvis. It's been a little bit since I've uploaded any videos, so I'm back with some more content. And this is going to be an unboxing of something that I've ordered because I have been doing a lot of shopping and not really uploading videos. And unfortunately also getting in trouble for my shopping. I mean, what can you do? Anyway, so, any of you that have been watching this channel, you know I, I like stuff, I like to collect things. Sometimes it's a good thing, sometimes it's a bad thing, is what it is. But I've recently kind of gotten into Coach again, and I actually think I have another video up here that I did unboxing of some items that I actually ordered. It was kind of a set of different things. I was online a couple days ago, and I actually saw that they came out with a Pride collection. It is Pride Month. It's June. So whoever you are, whatever you are, whatever you like, be yourself, embrace it, enjoy it, and celebrate you. This is our month to celebrate, gay, straight, bi asexual whatever you may be lgbtqa which i learned what the a was which it stands for asexual which means you don't want to be anybody but anyway got my pride shirt on anyway so this collection is actually a pride collection that coach came out with and i was kind of scrolling through and i saw it and i really liked it it's very interesting i'm a little nervous about the coloring which we'll get to once i take it out of the box but either way i'm a little excited about it because i really like the fanny packs i kind of like to not wear it on my waist like they did back in the early 90s which I was a kid so you can kind of drape it going across or you can kind of carry it off to the side but I carry a pretty big wallet I carry an accordion wallet so I like to have something to put that in I was putting it in my pocket for a little while and it can get kind of awkward because it, it sits out and in fact this is the bag that I got before and on there now I've got a this is actually an airpod case which I think is kind of cool pretty neat it just sits in there and it kind of coordinates but if you're wondering what an accordion wallet is this is an accordion wallet so it's long it's zippered and it's got a couple different compartments in there that you can put cards and space for money and it's got a zippered section here down in the middle and these have kind of come in for men not just a standard wallet I carry a lot of stuff so I really like to have space to have everything kind of in one place so I'm not missing something. If I've got a doctor's appointment, I have somewhere to keep my insurance card or my, my dental insurance, whatever the case may be. So with that, let's go ahead and get into the box. So this is the box that got delivered. It actually got delivered really quickly. I, th I think I ordered this, I want to say, ordered, was it Monday? It might have been last week. It was it was only a couple days ago, so it actually shipped out really quick, and I'm pretty sure this is what this is in this box. So let's see. Let me not cut myself because they do their boxes really weird. There's a lip that goes over this instead of just the seam, so it is what it is. All right, well, let's see what we got here. Let's tilt her down. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that. Isn't that glorious? And you can already kind of see what we've got. Very, very colorful things. It's going to be awesome. So let's actually start with the wallet. Now, this is a accordion wallet. It's smaller. And I figured it made sense to get something a little bit smaller in order to go in this particular fanny pack. It's not a terrain bag. The other one that I showed you is considered a terrain bag. But this one is a knot so let's go back up the face there we go so here's this one i think it's pretty freaking cool you've got the classic coach logo on there and it's transitioned in rainbow color now this is a white color which i kind of wish they would have done black with the rainbow stuff or a darker color but it, it does stand out more on the white so just like my other wallet and the zipper on this is gold nice little accent so it's smaller still got money for you to keep your cash in there and it has a nice little zipper compartment for change and things like that and it's got a few card slots not very many but it does have a few so this is going to be a challenge trying to figure out what to put in here and it seems like I may end up having to carry two wallets or something a little bit smaller to stick cards in and I've got a couple different card cases so hmm figured out it'll be a challenge but I really like this piece I think it's beautiful really nice feel on the leather as always coach never disappoints at least me and now to the main attraction 
This is the fanny pack. And I think this one's actually called the fanny pack and not a terrain bag like the other one. Oh, excuse me. It's called a belt bag, which is a fancy way of saying fanny pack. So they package their stuff up really good. I've always been very pleased with how they package everything. Keeps it nice and safe. Okay. So some more packing. Now this bag, I've seen it in person. It's got a slightly different shape than the terrain bag. The terrain bag gives me that extra pocket and it's also got a pocket back here on the back that's kind of hidden. This one appears to have one as well. It's right there, so it's, an, it's a different shape, which will take a little bit of getting used to. So we're actually going to take a lot of these things off because I want you guys to see the detail. But the Coach C, and it's in rainbow colors, which is super, super nice. I think that that's really pretty. As I said with the wallet, I'm a little worried about that white background and that it might get dirty, but I've got some cleaner and different things like that, so hopefully I can keep it clean. And it kind of has a, a, a glossy slash matte finish, if that makes any sense. So I think it should wipe off pretty easily if it gets dirty. I'll definitely have to make sure I'm not just sitting it on the floor of the car or something like that so it can pick up dirt. Take all these off so you can see all the details. This is really, really cool. I'm a, I'm really big on small details with things, like little tags and stuff like that. And in fact, on my terrain bag, it had a little leather tag right here, and it fell off in a grocery store or something, and I've not been able to find it. So that kind of makes me sad. I honestly didn't notice it until probably well later. So this one, I hope it does not come off. And that's kind of the case with these type of little clasps. They can fall off. Those little bead pulls. You see them on ceiling fans and things like that. So about 20 minutes later, I'm still taking stuff off. All right. Let's see here. Get this one off too. Like I said, they do a really good job packing this stuff up. I'm definitely impressed. It definitely protects it during travel. Okay. So, we got it all the way out. You see the pools here are nice rainbow colored. They coordinate with the seas. Love this coach tag. That's pretty awesome. It's brown and it's got coach leatherwear on it in the rainbow colors, which that plays off of the brown up here on top. So pairing that brown with that white, I think was a really good choice. If you, they did black, it would have looked off, I think. It's kind of got the nice metal class back there. And where you adjust it, this is a lot like my terrain bag. It's got these little leather pieces on the belt part for you to kind of hold them in place so it's not like flopping over to the side when you're wearing it. And inside. Now, one thing I am concerned with, this doesn't open up that far. I kind of think it should have gone out a little bit more to the sides because even now, I'm trying to get into it, it feels a little tight, but this is a bunch of packing paper and stuff in it, so that's probably part of it. With that opening, I do feel like it needs to be a little bit bigger. But it might be so that it, it kind of kind of curve over your torso. So that's the inside of it. That logo is being played on again, which is super nice. And it's got a little pocket back there, so not as much space as my terrain bag. I do think I probably prefer my terrain bag because it's a little bit wider. So this would definitely be to not carry as much stuff in. Although I see what they did here. This pocket's actually pretty big. It's a, I feel like I've got more space and a bigger opening back here than I do in that front part. So they probably should have reversed that. So. And honestly, it would just kind of, you kind of just take it and just put it on it would kind of sit here. This is actually, I feel a lot bigger <laughs> than this one, the way that it sits. But still, I mean, I'll be able to carry what I want to carry. I haven't adjusted the strap. And then on the back here, you've got a nice rainbow belt buckle or belt for it, depending on how you want to wear it. Now, most of this stuff retails for particular prices. This one, okay. So, retail price on this guy is $298. I got it off of coachoutlet.com 
four looks like 89.40 is what they ended up charging so say 90 bucks for this so not bad at all considering the quality of it it's got a really nice feel and i kind of and it's, it's definitely going to be durable like i said i do worry about cleanliness with this light of a color of something but i haven't really had any problems with this one but this is also not leather all the way around it's padded on the back and you've got the coated canvas on the front that, that you see that are the c's there so 89 bucks for this the wallet ran me about 55 dollars and so nice set for what 150 bucks 160 bucks with tax which is a lot less than buying at retail still expensive I'll, I'll i'll give them that you know i have to give credit where credit's due but you know you're gonna pay for quality i love coach i have a lot of coach things now probably more than i've had in the past and that's this stuff lasts for years and they actually do kind of back their stuff up with a, a warranty I don't really know all the specifics of it right now, but I think you, if when they had that canvas stuff, you could take it in. They would send it off to get it cleaned and different things like that. I actually probably need to ask about my terrain bag now that I'm thinking about it. Maybe I'll go in there over the weekend, make an appointment, and ask if I can get a replacement little tag for it. They might be able to help me out with that, which I just thought of in this moment. But that's it for this video. Thank you for tuning in. There'll be more content coming. I'm still kind of trying to figure out with some kind of how to change things up and what to do, what to deliver. I'm actually thinking about doing, or it was suggested to me, I should say, having a what's in my closet section since I've got so much shit. <laughs> I have a Funko Pop collection that I've talked about before, and I've actually done a few videos, but I've not kind of gone through the entire collection. So it's probably going to be time to pull all those bins out and kind of go through so you guys can see how ridiculous I've been in collecting that stuff. But that's it. Before you leave the channel, do not forget to subscribe below. Feel free to comment. And as always, I appreciate you guys. Thanks for tuning in. And for this moment in time, Universe Jarvis is out. Take care.